Hello everyone, this is Dr. Vignesh. This is my first blog and I will be posting a few difficult topics in medicine to make it easier for you. Do let me know in the comment section and don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you like it. Thank you. Today I will be discussing the topic lumbar plexus. If you like it, do let me know. Thank you. Hello everyone. Today we will be discussing the topic lumbar plexus. So, lumbar plexus. I will try my best to make the lumbar plexus much easier. Today to start with it, I will be drawing the roots T12, L1, L2, L3, L4 and L5 and draw this give it us some straight lines to make this simpler I'm just using the roots as well as the terminal branches and nothing much so just like each each root will give the sides to two arrows take it one two one two one two one two and one two okay and now we'll be doing this the upper part of t12 comes under subcostal that is t12 and then this join these two together forms the ilio hypogastric that is t12 and l1 next l1 this is ilio inguinal that is l1 and now leave a space between these two and then join these two these two together forms the genito femoral nerve that is l1 and l2 okay and now what you have to do is join the upper part of l2 and upper part of L3. These two together form the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve that is L2 and L3 and now the lower portion of L3, L2 and the upper portion of L4. These two, these three together form the femoral nerve that is L2, L3 and L4. Leave a space between these two and then you, uh, create an arrowhead okay between the L3 and L4. Add one from L2 to this. So this is a different slightly different to all these and this forms the obturator nerve that is L2, L3 and L4. The rest, the remaining is the lower portion of L4 and the L5. These two together form the lumbosacral trunk. And this unites with sacral plexus. To remember all these, you can have a mnemonic. She interested in getting laid on Fridays. She stands for subcostal, I stands for iliohypogastric, I N stands for ilioinguinal, G stands for genital femoral nerve, L stands for lateral cutaneous, lateral femoral cutaneous nerve, O stands for obturator nerve and F stands for femoral nerve. So this is lumbar plexus made simple. Thank you.